Hello everybody, I am just Lance and I am happy to welcome you all back for another video. Anyways, it's been a, a little bit. Um, I didn't do a lot of filming in 2022 for the channel, but I'm hoping that this first shave of 2023, um, it's January 8th, 2023, so I'm hoping that this first shave of 2023 will go ahead, set me off for a much better year. Um, been having a lot of stuff going on. I'll get into that in the shave. But anyways, so in this shave, since it was going to be the first shave of 2023, I wanted to start it out with some products I really, really enjoy. Um, and I may possibly have not been using a whole lot on or off camera. So, the razor is, I believe it's around 1908 or so. And it is a Canadian-made Gillette single ring. The blade in it is a Persona Lab Blue. It is an old type head, which has an open comb. Really cool razor. It's a three piece. The brush is one that I got from Dennis. And it is this one, the um, Sterling Two Band Finest Badger. I haven't used that in a while, I figured I'd pull it out. The soap is one that I absolutely love the scent of. It is by Razor Rock and it is Alchemy. I absolutely love this scent. Now I've never had any straight aqua marine type scent soaps, but I think this may be a little bit of an aqua scent. I'm not sure. It just smells really good. Love the scent of it. We will be topping the shave off with the matching splash. So, I'm going to go ahead, mix up my lather in my black and silver shave bowl. So, I'll go ahead and cut away. I come back after I get this soap lathered up. See you in a minute. There we go, guys. It's done. Nice thick lather. Ended up getting some soap on the handle. I'm a messy latherer, so let's go ahead and wipe that off real quick. All right, got the handle wiped down. Get the face wet. There we go. Not a bad brush. Feels pretty decent on the face. I believe the knot is 26 millimeter. Displays good. I had some soap fall off my face. Thought about doing a straight razor shave, but I just really wanted to use this setup. Hmm. Hang on. Here we go, do a quick paint over. So I hope everybody's Christmas and New Year's went well. dry my hands so we can start this first pass so yeah anyways 
2022. Be quite honest, was a very rough year for me. Um, I'd say the closest thing I could say to it. Very nice. These lab blue blades are smooth, sharp. But, um, the only thing I could explain is I think I was dealing with depression. Um, I was getting mad easy about stuff. Um, getting upset about things that, you know, when things happen, it was like unavoidable. I was not taking care of myself the way I should. Um, not eating like I should. I was just withdrawn a lot from friends, family, all that. There's a couple of you out there that probably understands what I'm saying as far as the drawing back because, well, there's certain people that I've made friends with or have had for a very long time. And I just... I wasn't staying in contact with them, just kind of going radio silent. Anyways, go and rinse off. But yeah, going radio silent. Not watching videos like I used to. Starting to get back into the videos. There's a couple of videos I commented on that, well, um, I need to comment back. Um, John Shaves 101. And a couple other guys. So for commenting on one of your guys, is anybody out there that I've commented on videos of and I didn't respond really? Um, I apologize. I think I'd go like two, three weeks between shaves. Um, that's just not me. Okay. But yeah, not, not shaving. Actually, you know, shaving, that's not me. Um, I take showers, not shave, which ain't me either. Um, sometimes a little too long between showers. And, uh, ain't good. Especially when you have a hey, old son that you now, hey dude, you gotta stay clean, you gotta shower, wash your hair, and he's looking at you like, you don't. Now, 
little kid, they don't understand. Yeah, okay, he's dealing with some depression issues. Or... Closest. Thing. I would. Consider depression. But it's a new year. Son's playing with the dogs. Um, new year. And I just hope it gets better. One moment so I can rinse off with the third pass. But, you know, it's... And I figured that if I start feeling like that again, I'm going to do the right thing as a boyfriend, father, son, brother. That's it. Is I will go get help because I'm tired of this. And part of it too, my insomnia has just been off the freaking hook past six, seven months, maybe a little longer to where I'm not getting to sleep until what? Between 5 and 6 a.m. Sleep like three, four hours. Be up throughout all day. And until 5 or 6 again in the morning. Against growth. Yeah, these single rings, they are aggressive. They are definitely aggressive. Um, I've heard that the American single rings are better as far as the quality of the shave. But uh, this Canadian made one is pretty damn good, actually. I ended up getting this. It's not a matching set, but got off Etsy in the Gillette single ring traveler case. Even has the little little book with King C Gillette on it. It's got two little silver plated canisters that one was for a soap stick or a Gillette soap stick and the other was for a brush. Fortunately, um, it did not come with the blade bank. But the case is in really, really good shape. You want to see it, the case and everything. Uh, look back a little bit, and it's number 99 or number 100, the razor. Not really gonna work my lip over because I haven't been shaving like I should. So I rinse off and be back for see how it came out. Good, good. 
pretty good on your chin, pretty good on the upper lip. Really whack down my problem area. All right, let's go ahead and hit it with the Razor Rock Alum Stick. No cuts, a couple of nicks, not bad, not bad. A little bit on my upper lip. A little bit right there. First time I used this single ring, I ran a Gillette Wilkinson Sword Saloon Blade in it. It did not like that blade combination, or my face did not. But Astra's, Personal Lab Blues, apparently, they work really good in it. All right, set that up there to dry. Anyways, I'm gonna let this sit for a minute. Um, cut away, shave my head, and uh, I'll see you for the post. Good, very good. Head's great. That is how the hell you start out a new year, ladies and gentlemen, even though I'm eight days late. <laughs> um, anyways, so let's do the post here. T. Dickinson's Watch Hazel. The soap, absolutely wonderful. The razor, old Gillette single ring. A little on the aggressive side when you compare it to something like a super speed or an aristocrat or even a fat boy or whatever but it is an old type open comb so that's not surprising um the blade persona lab blue still going strong third shave great blade um the brush what was it 50 something bucks for one of those sterling brushes Absolutely great brush for a low price, a lower price, um, what do you call it? Um, badger, finest badger brush. Um, I'm not sure which one this is, but heck with it, we'll use it. Used a little too much, so. Anyways, rinsed off my hands. Turns out that bomb was every man jack. Now, time for the aftershave. Give it a nice shake. But yeah, brush everything just works so wonderful. Very, very happy with the shave. Couldn't start the year off with much better. A little bit too much aftershave, but what the heck. It's got some sting because of the alcohol. Mm, the smell is just absolutely, the scent is just absolutely amazing on this alchemy. We'll go ahead, rub it into the shirt. And it lasts for a bit too. So, anyways guys, that is the shave. Thank all of you for joining me. Um, lost a few subscribers in the high in my hiatus, but, you know, not surprising. Um, it's fine. I'll get them back or I'll get new subscribers. Um, you know, I don't blame anybody for sitting there saying, hey, I'm going to unsubscribe from this guy. It's been a while since he made a video. I understand it. I got it. I ain't going to complain. But anyways, for all of you who didn't unsubscribe, for all of you who've been here for a while, and all of you who have recently subscribed in the past, few months um, since my last vi couple of videos thank you so much guys I appreciate the support um, I'm I'm gonna do my best to go ahead and get more videos on um, more often than every couple of three months and um, you know we'll see how it goes 
and let's just hope this year goes better than last. Anyways, y'all take it easy. Likes, comments, subscriptions, always appreciate it. My email address is in my about section. Um, contact me if you need to get in touch with me for anything. Um, and if you do subscribe, go ahead and click on notifications and select all. That way you know when I drop a new video. Anyways, y'all take it easy, and I shall see all of you on the flip side of the blade. Bye-bye now.